You know, with this scientific challenge, we wanted to use this as a vehicle to really drive the awareness and excitement of exactly what this new system could do. Our third place winner is Una McVeigh, and she will study the genetics of breast cancer in the population of West Ireland. So my name is Una McVeigh and I'm studying at the Lamb Institute for Translational Research in the National University of Ireland, Galway. She will receive three sequencing runs on the mini-seq facilitated by Luna. My research focuses on the inherited predisposition to breast cancer and is supported by an Irish charity, Breast Cancer Research. I'm trying to identify clinically actionable mutations that predispose women to breast cancer. This is a topic that is I have both professional and personal interest in. My own mother was diagnosed with breast cancer at 34. So thankfully she's alive and well today, but for many women diagnosed around the same age as her, and at the same time, they haven't had the same outcome. I'm investigating the genetic predisposition to breast cancer that isn't yet explained by mutations in high-risk genes like BRCA1 and 2, so that we can identify those women at greatest risk and enable them to make decisions about their care before cancer develops. Our results will have a significant impact internationally as even, for example, in North America, 11% of people identify as having Irish ancestry. The power of NGS to really unlock the genome was just absolutely illustrated in the applications. You know, all the way from broad molecular biology to oncology to infectious disease to inherited disease, research uh, topics covering public health, um, truly remarkable, I mean, and amazingly illustrative of really what uh, a sequencer, even as small and simple as the MiniSeq is, really can do. The MiniSeq is a great platform to start out on. We're trying to introduce next generation sequencing to our lab, so I think gaining experience on this simpler model is a great way to start.